Hi home gardeners. Welcome back in Plant Do channel. This time, I'll give you video about best plants for terracotta pots to decorate your lovely home. Well well well, before go to the video please like and subscribe for supports this channel. Okay, let's go to the video. Terracotta planters have been a favorite with gardeners for a long time. They are especially useful if you tend to overwater plants because their porous nature makes overwatering nearly impossible. Their unglazed nature allows air to get into the soil, helping your plants to thrive. Their rustic color adds a natural flair, and it is nearly impossible to beat their durability. They also help keep your plants cooler in the summer and warmer in the winter. Some plants do exceptionally well in terracotta pots. Let's take a look at these 12 plants that thrive in terracotta pots. Number 12. Chain of Hearts or Serapija woodii. Often called the sweetheart plant, the chain of hearts grows up to 4 feet tall, but its trailing vines can be up to 13 feet long. If you want this plant to have dark green leaves, then put it in direct sunlight. If you prefer the look of paler leaves, then put it in indirect sunlight. Tubers form at leaf notches. The leaves can be up to 2 inches long. Mature plants often have a woodier appearance than immature ones. Number 11. Ponytail Palm or Bucarnia Recurvata The ponytail palm is a unique-looking plant that grows well in terracotta pots. This plant has a funnel-shaped caudex that sits on the pot soil. Then, it has a narrow, trunk-like stem that ends with fountain-like leaves. This plant may develop multiple stems as it ages. Creamy white flowers appear on mature plants during the winter. Number 10. Dracaena Dracaena is a group of over 120 different plants. The Song of India is a common houseplant from this group. It commonly grows to be about 3 feet tall when grown as a houseplant. The leaves on this option are a yellowish-green outlined in darker green. Each leaf can grow up to 3 feet long. These plants love filtered light from a bright window. They need to dry out between waterings. Used water that has had fluoride removed because this plant does not like fluoride. Number 9. Sago Palms or Cycus Revoluta Plant a sago palm in a soil-based planting soil amended with sand, place it in indirect light, and watch it thrive. This slow-growing plant will live for many years. Each of the arching leaves on this plant has a large midrib and spiny-tipped, dark green leaflets. The leaves form a symmetrical rosette. This option is very susceptible to root rot, so putting it in a terracotta plant helps ensure you do not overwater it. Number 8. Aloe Vera Put your aloe vera in a terracotta planter since it is hard to overwater plants in them. The lancelite leaves on this option can grow up to 18 inches long. This option loves the sun. When you take excellent care of your aloe vera plant, it will produce small yellow flowers in the summer. Number 7. String of Pearls the tiny, pea-shaped leaves on the string of pearls make it a favorite with many houseplant lovers. It can also be planted in an outside hanging basket and brought in before the first frost. White flowers appear on this option during the summer. This plant can withstand frequent periods of forgetting to water it because each leaf's middle is filled with water. Plant this option in a cactus soil soil mix. Number 6. Ficus. There are about 850 types of ficus globally, and many of them grow very well in terracotta pots. The most common choice grown as a houseplant is a weeping ficus. Regardless of its size, it will have a trunk, so many people like to use them as bonsai trees. This option loves bright light and high humidity in the summer. Therefore, it is ideal in a west-facing window if you put a pan of water under it and mist it occasionally. Other common ficus options include the rubber plant and creeping fig. Number 5. Swiss Cheese Plant or Monstera Deliciosa Put a Swiss cheese plant in a terracotta pot with an upright stick and watch this plant thrive. This option has long lobed leaves. As the leaves mature, they will develop holes in them that many say looks like Swiss cheese. This option thrives in indirect sunlight in rooms kept between 60 and 85 degrees. One of the reasons this plant does well in terracotta planters is it likes to be on the drier side. Number 4. Peperomia 
Peperomia is a member of the peppercorn family, and globally there are over 1,500 types available. Most options have stout stems and fleshy leaves. One of the most popular peperomias to grow as a houseplant is the Peperomia obtusifolia, often referred to as the baby rubber plant. This option does excellent with very little water and indirect light. Number 3. Philodendron. There are over 450 types of philodendrons available. If you are looking for an option that does well in hanging terracotta baskets, consider climbing philodendrons. If you want the planter to sit on a table or the floor, then a self-heading option is usually best. Most options with velvety leaves do not like direct light and demand a higher level of humidity than other choices. Almost all philodendrons require lots of water, so choose a potting soil that will help retain moisture. Number 2. Snake Plants Terracotta pots that are wider than they are tall are ideal for growing snake plants. This stemless plant produces sword-shaped leaves that usually mature to be between 2 and 4 feet tall. These fleshy leaves are dark green with gray-green horizontal stripes. While this plant can produce small greenish-white flowers and orange berries, it seldom will when grown indoors. And the number one is, succulents. More than 25 plant families have at least one succulent member, with many having multiple ones. Terracotta plants are ideal for them because the clay's nature helps to draw moisture out of the soil. Among the easiest succulents to grow in an indoor pot are jade plants, aloe vera, echeveria, and zebra plants. Well, thanks for watching my video about 12 best plants for terracotta pots to decorate your lovely home. Don't forget to like and subscribe for supports this channel. Also, you can turn on the notification bell for more updated videos. See you home gardeners.